So what's going on guys, KDC here, welcome back to a brand new video and today we are checking out the top 10 most fun hide and seek maps in Fortnite creative mode. In general I looked up more than 100 map codes and these 10 new maps are the best ones. In this list you'll be able to find super cool castles, modern styled mansions, even summer themed cities, beautiful looking samurai island and much more. So if you are ready to have some fun then let's get right into it. Then for the first map on the list we have an amazing super island kingdom. So here we have a massive hide and seek map with hundreds of different buildings, super cool 10 out of 10 design structures, even secret hiding spots and much more. So if you're looking to have a super fun time then this is the map exactly for you. So check this one out and enjoy! Then with that said, going over to the second map on the list which is a Samurai City hide and seek map. So in this one you can bring up to 16 players and all of them split to two teams. The first team are the seekers who look for players and the other one are the hiders who hide in the city till they get found. This map is perfect for medium sized groups with added speed boosts for hiding players so they could find their hiding spots a lot quicker. If you are interested in one of the most beautiful maps ever then try this one out and have fun. Then for the third map on the list we have a modern mansion hide and seek map. So this whole map is one huge mansion with bunch of different rooms, many hiding spots, even a lot of secret entrances and much more. And of course at the same time all the hide and seek mini game rules apply in this map as well. So try this one out for yourself and good luck. Then taking a closer look at the next map which is the one and only summer themed farmland map. So for this video I was looking for not only fun and featured packed maps but as well super cool looking and colorful designed buildings and places and this is what I found. Oh and by the way this map is in a different language so just seekers and hiding players will be automatically teleported to their spots and whenever the first 60 seconds are done the seekers will get released and let the match begin. So if you are ready to take your gameplay to another level then try this amazing hide and seek map out and have fun. And with that said now we have come to the fifth map called the dream island hide and seek. So here we have a super unique map in the night mode. Like in any other map you can go inside the buildings, look for secret passageways, try to not get found by the seekers for as long as you can and much more. So if fun and good time sounds good to you then this is the map for you so enjoy. Then as for the next map we have the beautiful winter city map. So when the mini game starts the players can pick either way to be a seeker or the hiding player. Then all participants get teleported to go hiding in the city or wait few minutes to be released and hunt all the rest of the hiding players. As this map is medium sized it's perfect for small friend groups or big groups but faster rounds. So I strongly recommend for you to try this map out and have fun. Then moving over to the 7th map on the list which is a seaport hiding map. 
So this map story is that there's only one debt collector who is trying to take all of your money away. So you have to hide from him with the rest of the players for as long as you can. The longer you don't get found, the more money you will get which then you can exchange to revive other players or buy better hiding equipment. So if this sounds interesting to you then check this map out and good luck! Then for one of the last maps on the list we have the one and only Swamp Cross Hide and Seek map. So here we have a super amazing swamp built in a small town styled where everywhere you go you can see fallen trees, a lot of small buildings and stuff like that. So if you're looking for a harder map to play hide and seek in, with disadvantages having a lot of water and dark shadow spots where players can hide very easily, then this is the best map for that. So check it out and have fun! Then the night map on the list is one of my most favorite ones which is an amazing food fishing pier map. So when I was looking for different maps this one catched my eye so let me explain. First things first, this map is one huge fishing port where players can hide anywhere they want. But if they are super lazy or can't decide where to hide, then at the beginning of the match you can click to random teleport and you will be teleported to a random hiding spot. So yeah, I thought that this one feature is kinda cool and I haven't ever seen it done before. So if you wanna try it out, then here it is. And with that said, now we have come to the last map on the list called the Red Dead Redemption Prop Hunt map. So in the hide and seek minigame itself there is another way to play it, where instead of hiding your whole Fortnite character, you can become any object or item in the map. So you try to blend in as much as you can and try to hide from the seekers. I personally had a lot of fun playing this map out, so if you want to check it out then this is it. And with having all this said, I really do appreciate everyone for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or suggestions for the next top 10 list, feel free to comment that in the comment section down below. If by any chance you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and enable that notification bell so you won't miss any more amazing top 10 lists or anything else. With that said, have an amazing day and I will see you in the next one. So take it easy, peace. Yo, I ain't here for the